Turn it up, mm. turn it up, turn it up, turn it up. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? How you doing? My name Ma. What was it? Ma. Mog? Ma. Like you going to the mall. Oh, mall. Okay, yeah. okay, thank you. <laughs> and how old are you? 29. And what do you do? I work at a broker dealer as an uh, employee conduct officer. Okay, cool. Uh, what are some things you like to do for fun? For fun, I'm, I like playing basketball, going out, sightseeing. I love food, so I like going out to eat, you know, shit like that. Uh -huh. And I like hanging out with friends. Okay, nice. Yeah. Uh, what are some things you look for in a oh, woman? You can tell you a little nervous. In a woman, I like my woman kind, sweet. Of course, she gotta be fine as hell. <laughs> I like my woman that look good. And then also, then she take care of her health. Okay. You feel me? She eat the right shit. She go to the gym. She take care of her body. I like that. Okay. And now, what are some of your deal breakers? Hey, based on that, redhead, you gotta pop. But see, be, like some ladies be hearing what, they, like they be popping for reasons of uh, that other people say that they definitely not attracted to okay that's fair but then if you want to be honest you got to stay consistent pop when he said stay in the gym redhead should be popping a bit behind chin i'm sorry guys my deal breakers just uh a mean a mean woman some woman who always angry who got anger issues and i also don't like like a sense of entitlement. Mm -hmm. Like I, if I feel like you entitled in any type of area, though, I'm not, I'm not gonna like it's going it's gonna make me want to not want to be around you. Okay. So yeah, it's like stuff like that. All right. So we haven't got any pop balloons yet. Okay. You're the first of this episode. I'll tell you that. Really? <laughs> <laughs> All right. So with that being said, I'm actually gonna switch it on over to you. There are okay. quite a few girls. <clears throat> so for the first round, I'm gonna have you pop. Three balloons. Three balloons? Three balloons based off of what you're seeing. Whoever doesn't really fall right in hype, so okay. let me give you a hey, pick. Hey, hold on, hold on. We're going to do this pop for him. I want him to pop red. Red has to be dead, okay? Red got to get popped, right? We got to get her out of here because she don't like to go into the gym, and we're not playing that because she, she want to pick and choose what she, you know, what reasons she has. Let's get, let's get her out of here. Uh, white, tall, white girl, or, or the white dress, get her out of here. She's always going to say he's not tall enough um, if if she don't want to find another reason. So get her, get the white, get the red out of here. And um, let's go ahead and get, let's go ahead and get, um, it, just, just those two get on my nerves. But let's see. All right. There you go. And then go ahead and pop those three. Shit, it's tough. <laughs> yes. No. Okay, okay well, two yeah, more. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. Oh, what? Yeah, one more. One more. Pop the white one with the white dress. Wow. Okay, Thank since you. we're here, we'll start here first. All right. All right, if we can have your name and age. My name is Renee. I'm 25. And Renee, why did you have your balloon unpopped? So I, I like your accent. Where are you from? I'm from Philly. I like your accent. Thank um, you. I like your outfit today. Thank you. Um, you're not my initial type because of the hype, but like I said, okay. I did like the things that you were saying. I like your accent. Very handsome. Appreciate it. Thank you're you. Thank welcome. you. All right, so why did we end up popping her balloon? Uh, just, just not really my type for real. Okay. You feel me? That's, That's it. really it, though. That's it. Okay. So, what makes her not really your usual type? Um, she's a little more on the taller side. That's all. She's smart. Hey, <laughs> right, right. All right, thank you. And then we did pop <clears throat> two more. Start over here. Your name and age. I'm Kay. I'm 27. Okay, and Kay, why did you have your balloon unpopped? Um. He just wasn't ugly. <laughs> I like I like what he was talking about. Um, yeah. Okay, nice. So now, why do we end up popping hers? Honestly, she looked good, but I don't like chest tats. Respect it. Hey. I appreciate that, though. No problem. And then you did pop one more down here. Your name and age, and why did you have your balloon unpopped? Hello, Kia, twenty nine. I good. How are you? I'm good. I couldn't really hear what you were saying so I was just giving you an opportunity to, to hear a little bit more okay. okay but is he your usual type um um he looks like my cousin shout out to my cousin TJ hey <laughs> but we're an attractive family so you're not yeah, yeah. hey I noticed when she was gonna give her her answer right before 
his eyes started squinting, like as if he was trying to like make her look, look or make himself look better. Like, oh yeah. Let me see you go back. Like, say something nicer or something like that. I don't know. I, I thought it was funny. Look at me walking past yeah, you. Yeah, your you know name and age, and why did you end up popping your balloon? My name is Kamina Twenty Seven. It's just a glitter comic because I love glitter. Like I was oh actually wear some around my chest, bro. but I just didn't. She popped for somebody else's reason. Hold oh my, bro. That's so annoying, bro. Pop for because he said something about glitter, and I and I keep on turning my head because the mic is kind of strong. But what the heck, man? That is just the most... Somebody drop it in the comments, man, of how dumb that was. She likes glitter, and he made a comment about glitter. Nothing that is that serious. Nick, because I didn't have time, but... <laughs> yeah, I love glitter. <laughs> oh, okay, but is he someone that is your type? Everybody yeah, he's very confused. handsome, well-groomed. I love the way he dressed. The watch is nice, yeah. Yes. Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. So she your type? No, yeah, she look good. Yeah, I like a little chocolate woman. Thank you. <laughs> but I ain't, I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't like the bangs hairstyle. Like, I don't want to see more of your face. Oh, uh, really? Yeah. I just decided to do this hairstyle to try something new. So usually yeah. I don't have bangs, but... Okay. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Okay. yeah get Let's the bang out back. of here. All right. So for our remaining ladies, I'm going to go ahead and have you ask them a question, wow. help you narrow it down. Okay. The first one is, is not... Uh, what's your boundaries in a relationship? relationship okay let's start well, down there we always start strong. here we'll uh, go over there first a strong question right there uh-huh you're first <laughs> your name and age and what's your boundaries in a relationship let me think um uh, my name that. is christina i'm 24 How you doing? i say my boundaries is like just overbearing and like don't know when to like give space okay that's yeah okay good yeah okay <laughs> your name age and what are your boundaries my name is Carrington. I'm 26. Um, I have quite a few, actually. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, so one is arguing. I don't like arguing. We can discuss all day long, um, but yelling or being disrespectful, I'm yeah. not okay with that. Um, so that's for one. Um, <clears throat> there's quite a few. I don't. I'm trying to figure out how to word some of them. So uh, take your time. That's that's really my biggest one right now. Like I said, I'm in a place where. I can't any form of abuse at all. Um, let's see, I do not do any type of infidelity situations. Uh, if it has to do with a woman, you can have it. Um, I deal with a lot of other stuff, it's fine. Relationships go through things. Women is not a thing that I will go through. I got you, um, you know, there's probably a plethora of more, but those are my top two right now. Yeah, yeah. for sure, all right, but. Thank you. Your name and age and what are your boundaries in a relationship? Hi, I'm D. I'm 27, and also to somebody that is not God fearing. Okay. Yeah. Oh, she's definitely a West African. Your name and age, Somewhere. and what are your boundaries in a relationship? Hey, I'm Tara. I'm 24 years old. How you doing? Um, good. How are you? I'm well. <laughs> um, I would say my boundaries. I don't like a man who is very like judgmental, who doesn't want to like understand if we have issues. Yeah. Um, who I don't like argumentative people like that get loud. Mm. Um, definitely nothing like physical either. Right. Um, for me personally, I do like move slower in relationships. So um, I like to get to know a person first. So right. um, definitely not like first week, like we're staying at each other's house and you know, that kind you. of thing. So hey, I understand, yeah. I understand. Yeah. 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 Your name and age and what are your boundaries in a relationship? Hello, um, I'm Ish, I'm 28, and a couple boundaries for me would be like a guy that's mean. I can't do a mean guy. I don't want no no limit soldier. Yeah, I need I somebody understand. soft with me. Yeah. Um, so that's really big for me. Um, another one of my boundaries <clears throat> will probably be uh, having autonomy. I uh, think he might pick We're her. two individuals, even though we're in a relationship. So just respecting what one another does. Like you met me in a certain way. Don't try to change me and, once uh, you're with me. So that kind of thing. All right. Okay. What are your boundaries? Shit, most of my boundaries, uh, I don't like a woman for like a lot of male friends. Like I don't like all that. Like and also, uh, 
It's really, I would, I, honestly, I, I got more, but I, I would have to like we'll get to know one more. Okay, yeah, yeah, sure. no, you're so, good. Yeah. All right, so now with that being said, and you mm-hmm. know all the responses we've heard, you've seen go, them up man. close, all that good stuff. Go I am gym. now gonna have you pop two balloons. Two, two of them. Pop the red one. So man. whenever you're ready, head on over. Let me move out. Why he biting his lip, man? <laughs> that was light skin of him to bite his lip. Yeah, thank you. Get her out of here. Ah. Okay, and then one more. Ooh, one more. Don't do the dark skin girl, cause, cause y'all from both, y'all both from Philly. Hey. Okay, let's start with this one here. Here. So, um, Carrington, why did you have your balloon unpops for him? He's handsome. I like the way he talks. Um, eye contact. He gives a really masculine presence. Okay. Appreciate it. All right. So, why did we end up popping her balloon? Uh, honestly, I just like the other girls better. Okay. Fair enough. <laughs> Let's go over here. And so why did we end up uh, having our balloon unpopped? Um, I had it unpopped because I liked your energy. I liked the way you came today. You came dressed right. And yeah. Appreciate it. Mm-hmm. So why did we end up popping hers? Uh, Again, like I just like the other girls better. She look good. So I just purchased my first two vending machines. Oh, yeah, that's what's up. Okay. Thank you. What do you do? Uh, So currently I work for state government um, in IT as an application developer. Yeah. Okay. He popping her. And over here, what do you do? I'm an entrepreneur. I'm a personal trainer, and I also own a salon. She's a personal okay. trainer. <laughs> oh, you, you look like you wanted to say more. Are, are you no, thinking? I'm just thinking. Just oh, thinking. Okay. That's all. Just okay. thinking. Like, what are we thinking about? She's sure. a personal trainer. <laughs> That's surprising. I know. Like he's already thinking, who am I gonna pop? Because yeah. you know it's time. It is time to pop a balloon. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> All right, so to make it a little bit easier for you so you can, you know, get to know them a little bit more as well. Okay. Ladies, any questions for him? Okay, we got one down here. Okay, she got a question. So when you're feeling low in your spirit, what do you normally do to uplift your spirit? Uh, yeah, I like that question. So for me personally, what I like to do, I honestly like to go work out because it usually helps release. You understand? It helps me feel a lot better than what I'm going through in a particular moment. So whether somebody made me mad or whether I'm going through some hard or whether I'm going through some type of like stressful environment. Me, for me, when I go into the gym, it kind of helped me release all the attention and energy out there like that though. So, and then also like, I may, I may have to call a loved one, just have to have a, just talk about it. I may not go into detail about the situation, but I just, you know, just talk for a little bit. Then after that, I kind of get energized to go do what I need to do with it. So that's all. Okay, do you have kids? No, I ain't got no kids. I meant to ask that. You can ask that, so you want to ask her? You, can yeah, you got kids? Not yet. Not yet? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, any questions be from either that, one of you? That might not be her face, though. Yeah. Um, make, so what's some things on. that you learned from, like, past relationships? Well, some things I learned from past relationships. Just, uh, uh if you see the red flags, don't ignore them. Mm-hmm. Like, when you see the red flags... Take you know take take action, and then just probably dismiss yourself from the situation because ain't because honestly when you try to like change people, it's it, it's just not gonna work. You understand them mm-hmm. regardless of how, how regardless how how like how you're coming off whether your 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 conversation could be innocent your conversation could come off as you know you just want to help the individual but a lot of times they just don't see eye to eye. You understand yeah. so it is not you just can't change people. So you would say you gave people like a lot of grace in like your past relationships? Uh, yeah, you I did. Yeah. I did okay. though. Yeah, uh huh. I did. I used to give a lot of grace. Yeah. Okay. And I think you want to ask your your other question. Do you have any kids? Yeah, you got any kids? Uh, <laughs> no kids yet. No kids. Yeah, no kids. Okay. <laughs> any questions here? Yes. So, just for longevity purposes, how would you prioritize, um, wife, mother? Of course. Mm-hmm. And then the husband doing what he gotta do, but then the husband gotta look tend to the wife. And then when tend to the wife, then he can tend to the kids and all that extra shit. So, how would you? Your rank is wife, yeah. children. Yeah, wife. Yeah. So for me, so it starts with God. Me getting right. Yeah. Me getting right with God. Mm-hmm. Then me, and then the, the wife, and then the children. And then mommy. Then mommy. What is the mommy? Like my mom? What is she? What is the mommy like? Why the wife is a mom? What do you, what do you want? She gonna she she gonna mess herself up. Like what what the, help me guys. What does she want the mommy in there for? The mommy is the wife. But but that's a different role. But I don't understand. What is she asking? 
Yeah, that's what I asked. Like wife, I, mother, children. Yeah, How do you I prioritize mean, those? So it would be, it'll be wife, kids, then mom. Mom got to get her own nigga. Okay. Yeah. okay. <laughs> so she's talking about your mom. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, that's better. At first, I didn't know what she was talking about. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, I like his answer. Okay. And no, I don't have children. I'm a dog no. mom, though. Dog mom, but okay, okay. <laughs> All right. So I hope that made it a little easier yeah, for you now. Did, okay, did, good, good. So I am <laughs> going to have you pop a balloon. Let's see. He want to pop the one in the middle. I knew it. I knew oh, it, dog. Shit. All right. <laughs> so why did you have your balloon unpopped for him? Um, first of all, I love his accent. I love accents, like, all together. <laughs> like, I could just listen to him talk all day. Um, he seems like he got himself, like, really put together. He's really well-groomed. Um, I like the things he was saying. Um, he's not, like, initially my type, but I liked everything else about him. So, yeah, but he's very handsome. Thank you. Yeah. I appreciate it. Okay. So, why do we end up popping hers? Uh, honestly, I just need to pop one, bro. <laughs> He did say he liked him like Chocolate Queens earlier, yeah, so I was yeah. going to pop after that because I want him to like have what he wants. Right, right, <laughs> but right. um, yeah, I understand. Okay. All right, cool. Can I ask another one? To the, yeah. The, yeah, of course. Go uh, ahead. Where y'all from? Like, where y'all currently reside at? I reside in Michigan. Michigan? Yeah, the Detroit area. Oh, yeah? Not in Detroit, but around Detroit. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. And then we know she, said, she said she's from Philly, but do you? Live there yeah. now? I'm originally from Africa, motherland, Liberia. Okay. Liberia. Oh, never. I thought she, Liberia. I, I knew she was from Africa, though, because I could hear an accent, but I couldn't I couldn't pinpoint where, though, because the accent was a little bit off and on. It's kind of hard. Okay. Wow, Liberia. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, all right. So, any final questions between the two of you? Um... How do you, um, sorry, how do you um, uplift your lady spirit when she's feeling down? How I, how I uplift my lady spirit when she's down? Mm. <laughs> yeah, I, so for me personally, I, like, I try to give like positive affirmations. And if that don't work, I'll probably try to like maybe take you somewhere or we could probably get a workout done together. Just hope to build our vibe back up. And you said you like working out, so I like, I like that. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm straight. Okay, well then with that being said, is it going to be a yes for you for him? Yes. Okay, and is it a yes okay. for you for her? Yeah. We got a match! All right, let's see. <laughs> I'll take this mic and you guys can go on up. Oh, let's make some noise for them, y'all. <laughs> all right, all right. I know. 